Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. Today, we are on Enchanted MC's brand new OP prison room that has just released. Now, when I'm recording this video, I'm 30 minutes after they released. And when you're seeing this video, the server is released. So make sure to hop on right now using my IP, which is slate.enchantedmc.net. And this is going to be like episode one, kind of, and as well as a showcase video. But before we get into all of that, if I go ahead and hit a slash crates, we're giving away two things. Thing. So there's going to be two winners in this video. We're giving away an admin crate and a February crate, both monthly crates. So to enter to that, leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and drop your Minecraft username in the comment section down below. And in the next video, I'll roll the winner as we are starting a series on here. But we're going to be kind of starting this episode by showing off all the cool stuff. Starting with the pickaxe enchants, I was looking through them a little bit. And if I go to the tier four enchantments, look at these sick enchants. So the turn enchant, chance to spawn an ink crystal in the middle of your mine, and then shoot nearby players giving them a 2x enchant multiplier so that is like insanely overpowered for your gang and then slime ball enchant chance to uh, basically spawn a slime that explodes your mind and then the ghost chance to spawn floating pickaxes and so on tier three enchants they have freeze sinkhole nuker they have so many cool enchants and i'm stoked to get in to uh the series to be able to try them all that obviously i gotta grind a little bit because my pickaxe has to be level 200 to even get access to the turn enchant but hopefully by uh the end of this series we'll be able to do it now obviously they got a battle pass with lots of good rewards then one unique thing i've really not seen on a prison server recently is this outpost keeper so basically they have pvp here on the prison realm there's an enchant outpost which boosts your enchant experience token and money which also ex uh, boost those currencies so really cool i guess also pvp is kind of a big thing because uh that is very important and it looks like they got armor sets through mining you'll get artifacts to actually redeem this this armor which will give you better boost and experience key finder money and tokens and then over there it looks like they got pets to give you more boost and then they got an experience shop to use your experience which is all good and then over here they got a skill tree which basically the more you mine you just unlock rewards and then once you have the jackhammer enchant the more jackhammer procs the more rewards you get now if i go ahead and hop into this mine teleportation we can actually create our own mine candy mine winter mine drastic mine and aquatic mine we're definitely going with the candy mine it just looks so cool and it, and it sounds really cool but okay heck yeah sick template and it looks like we got our own personal mine that we're going to need to be upgrading i don't know if it upgrades as you rank up or as you prestige but i guess we'll find out so i'm just going to start mining right now and uh i guess i'll bring y'all back once i figure it out and rank up and all that oh my gosh wait one minute so we're already, this is extremely overpowered we are already rank 250 my golly now if i type slash prestige how does that work okay you have to be rank 1 million before you can prestige holy smokes now if i look at chat as you can see like dust for instance i played last skyblock map here on enchanted mc with him he's rank 4930 so i don't know if that if he's prestiged or what but yeah, this is actually looks like it's going to be kind of sweaty to prestige, but ranking up is easy, if that makes sense. Now, one thing I want to do to start out this series, as I said, this is kind of like episode one as well as a showcase video. But if I go ahead and hit slash crates, I want to open one February crate and one admin crate, because why not? I got to spoil myself a little bit. If I'm giving y'all one, I might as well open one for myself. So we got nine rewards brewing. Looks like we got a lot of stuff. Police boots. That's definitely going to be overpowered. A crap ton of tokens. Key finder crystals. Let's go. They have crystals on the server that boost their enchants. Our final reward, usually the best reward. Is that what it is? Okay, 3x pet boxes. Let's freaking ride, baby. What a start. Okay, so these boots, what they do, um, they give me a token multiplier that is massive. So I'll be able to enchant my uh, pickaxe with tokens. Then if I go ahead and right click these pet boxes, what do we get? We got a basic key finder, a rare experience, and then a basic jackhammer pet. Yo, jackhammer pet. This will multiply your jackhammer. I love to see that. We're going to go and uh, equip that. Now, if I do slash pets, how many slots do I get? I only get one right now, which makes sense. So we're going to go ahead and actually do our experience pet for now, just because I don't have either of these enchants. So they're kind of useless to me at the moment. Book of experiences, which is really good. I'll wait until my pets get higher level to use that because it basically levels up my pet and then these crystals 96 percent chance for it to apply 102 percent and 112 percent 95 percent that is massive we're gonna go and put the other one in my pv just in case if i create a gang for a teammate or something and uh, as far as this we're gonna go ahead and right click it or do we throw it on our pickaxe bang oh my gosh did it actually not work are you serious the crystal did not work it was like a 96 percent chance you hate to see it okay let me go and do this one bang wait what is this you already have oh it did work 
It must have worked because crystals, yeah, active slot. There we go, 112% key finder. Okay, so it did indeed work. We're going to go and put this one back. And now with my 350 million tokens, we'll go to the tier one uh, enchant area. And let's kind of look at what I want to do. Probably want to get speed. Probably want to get haste. Experience is good. Key finder, we have a booster for that. So let's go ahead and unlock. Let's just do 500 levels of that. And then token greed is probably where we want to just max out at 1,000 levels. So there we go. Pickaxe already looking somewhat good. I should, dude, I should have put some on jackhammer i'm so dumb oh my freaking gosh you hate to see it now did i get crate keys from the monthly crates i don't really know okay we have four mine crate keys we already got we'll go and open these okay i should have oh gosh no nope, dang it i don't want to watch this freaking animation i should have turned the animations off but we got some money and experience and then if i actually go back into the crates i want to see is there a way to turn off animation we'll turn it off there we go so we actually did get 10 enchanted keys let's go we opened all of these if we spam them there we go which gets us more tokens not really that much tokens but we'll go ahead and put them all on jackhammer and then what do we get here a president kit voucher yo we got a little kit which is good for pvp you love to see it so we're actually going to throw that all into my pv1 because that is going to be kind of necessary later when we go pvp trying to capture those outposts and so on but what a good start now we're going to go ahead and just keep mining and uh i'll bring y'all back okay now we just got a little donation from diploma as you can see that is his username in the chat and he actually gave me some of these money artifacts but the most important was this axp and token booster for 30 minutes for 2x both so i'm gonna go ahead and equip both of these and start grinding so shout out to diploma for the uh the donation also one thing i noticed if i do slash mine i was kind of looking into this and if i go to the mine upgrades basically you get this experience just for mining and each level you actually get a size upgrade so right now i'm on level one which is i believe oh no we haven't even unlocked level one so a level one will get us to size 12 once we get another about thousand exp and then so on so that's kind of how the mine upgrades work i don't think it has anything to do with ranking up and prestiging like i said before but uh yeah just wanted to let y'all know that's kind of how we upgrade the size of our mine now i know this episode is gonna kind of be shorter or not not really shorter, not necessarily shorter but not really content filled like we're not going to get too much done just because I want to get this video out ASAP as I want to get it out on the same day as the server actually released just to let y'all know so y'all can get started ASAP um, and not be falling behind from all the players that are playing on release. All right, so if you take a look at chat, this player is advertising that he's buying these money artifacts, which we have a lot for 2 billion. So I don't know. I'm guessing that means 2 billion money, which I feel like is a good deal. So we're going to get over there. Also in slash pass, I just realized I've completed two tiers. So that's a lot of tokens and keys just from the free reward so you love to see that now if i go back to slash crates we should have oh my gosh let's go nine of these keys open all of those open all of our mine keys as well four okay 0.4 seconds there we go and then we have 15 mine keys let's go so this key finder enchant is actually really overpowered especially with the boost so that puts us at 56 billion let's ride so if i do slash rank up there oh wait wait sorry do i have to do I have to oh my gosh wait i think we just okay we did just level up because our mine it looks like oh maybe our mine maybe that was just resetting i don't know if i do slash mine and look at the upgrades okay yeah sure enough we actually leveled up our mine so it got bigger you love to see that and we got a lot of tokens now so what i want to go ahead and do is look around i want to make sure i'm getting fortune too because this is gonna be big for money you're basically breaking more blocks so we can get 200 more levels of that i already got haste max out speed can we max it out yeah for 2.7 we're gonna go and do that speed's kind of crucial and then key finder we can get another 26 of that jackhammer another 78 you know what we're gonna do now is actually Actually just put it on fortune so we can get that higher alrighty well I think that is where I'm gonna end off this first video here on enchanted MC's brand new OP prison reel make sure you're using my IP to hop on which is slate enchanted MC.net but make sure you're looking out for the next couple of videos that'll be here on the series without the next couple of weeks and uh yeah but that, that's gonna be it I'll see you guys on the server make sure to hop on message me if so and uh, let me know if you uh, made it to the end of the video. Also, enter in those giveaways of the 1x monthly crate and admin crate. Now, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.